Your Windows setup is missing these three Windows apps. Let's fix that. These five apps are not the usual surface level apps and are seriously underrated and I think they are the only apps you will ever need. So sit back and watch until the end. First up, quick look. Ever scroll through a folder and wish you could peek inside a file without opening it? With quick look, you just tap the spacebar and it instantly shows you a preview of images, videos or PDFs. And that also means no time spent waiting for the file to load and open. For example, when I'm going through family thumbnails for my YouTube videos, I usually make 3 or 4 versions with tiny differences and it's easy to get lost. Quick look lets me check them instantly and find the right one without opening them all. Almost no one talks about it, but once you try it, you'll wonder how you lived without it. And it is criminal how this is not a Windows built-in feature as this is for macOS. For now, you can grab this in the store. Talking of macOS, features such as this should definitely be in Windows and there is a lot more, but that is a topic for another day. Next up, Ditto Clipboard Manager. You know when you copy something, then accidentally copy copy something else and lose it forever. Dito fixes that. It keeps a history of everything you've copied. Text, images, links. So you can go back and grab it whenever you need. No more digging through files or trying to remember where you saw that link. It's super lightweight, runs in the background and once you get used to it you'll wonder how you lived without it. Talking of files, I cannot be the only one to think that the file explorer has not aged like fine wire and desperately needs an overhaul. Although it has received multiple updates, if you're often for a more modern look you should definitely try out the files app. It gives you a built-in tab so you don't have to open a hundred windows just to move files around. It also has a dark mode, a cleaner, modern design and way smoother animations. You can customize the layout, quickly access cloud storage like OneDrive or Google Drive and even pin your favorite folders for faster access. Personally, I switched to it a while ago and I've barely touched the default explorer since. It just makes managing files so much easier and cleaner. However, it can be a little bit more draining on your computer so perhaps this might not be the best for you. If your setup is on the weaker side of the spectrum. Now, let's be honest, the default windows volume and brightness pop-ups are ugly and outdated. That's where modern flyouts come in. It replaces those chunky overlays with a clean, minimal and modern design that slides in smoothly from the side. It works for volume, brightness, airplane mode and even media controls when you are playing music or videos. You can customize where it pops up, how long it stays on the screen and whether you want it light, dark or transparent. It's such a small change but it makes the whole window setup feel way more polished and premium. By the way, I've got a video diving into the psychology of why some things feel premium and polished while others just don't. Check out the channel. Last up is screen to gif. This one's a game changer if you ever need to record your screen. It lets you quickly capture a part of your screen and turn it into a GIF or a video without needing any complicated software. It's perfect for tutorials, quick demos or even memes. You just select the area you want, hit record and whenever you are done there is a built in editor so you can trim, cut or add text right after recording. Although I personally use OBS Studio, this app is for you if you are a more casual user and you are not a YouTuber who is trying to reach 5 subscribers, please subscribe. It is lightweight easy to use and saves you from having to upload a full video just to show someone a quick screen action. If you found this useful, drop a like and if you are into these clean, simple tech upgrades consider subscribing and perhaps checking my other videos too as I make videos sometimes.